It's that time of year again, families gathering together to make sauce, or some call it sugo. But it may be a little harder to find this type of tomato this year. And that's for two reasons, COVID-19 and the heat. So this field is about 90% right now. That's a waste, it's garbage. Dominic DeFilippe is the owner of 19th Avenue Farm, says many fields have been impacted by COVID-19. This year, many growers chose to cut back on production because these type of tomatoes are labor intensive with low returns. Also, many anticipated labor issues this year. For Dominic, whose farm is in Markham, Ontario, he says he hasn't been impacted by the pandemic, but instead it's the high heat that has spoiled some of his crops. Due to heat, Lack of water, the calcium was not getting, is not getting into the tomatoes and also other nutrients also. So that creates a blossom end rot, which makes the end go black and rotten. Um, and we have major f losses in a lot of fields. Other produce items are also taking a bit of a hit this year for many different reasons. Our main two crops are carrots and onions. We've uh, been affected uh, right from the, the onset of the COVID-19, um, starting with our, our farms program. Um, with our, our migrant workers coming in, um, they weren't allowed to come in. Pretty much uh, across Canada, we're uh, very dependent on the farms program to run our farms. We still don't have all of our staff. They're still not approved to come over, so we only have uh, you know part staff. So it is, it is a definite challenge uh, from the, the labor standpoint. In addition to the labor, we've uh, had some uh, drastic increases in costs, uh, you know, modifying things on the farm, modifying things in the processing facility, modifying things across the board to make things uh, safe, uh, not only for our employees, but for our employees and our customers and our end customers. And the third uh, thing of this is the weather. Uh, you know, we've had the biggest drought and, you know, I've been doing this 26 years and this is uh, one of the biggest droughts I've ever experienced. As for making tomato sauce and scoring these plump red things, Dominic says there should be another harvest coming soon. There's going to be some tomatoes, just uh, I wouldn't panic that much. We, we're, we're picking. Uh, we're not picking the same account of volumes and, and yields like other years, and it's costing us more to pick. You know, people are thinking it's because of COVID. Not really. There's one thing about this industry. These are commodities. Uh, COVID has an effect definitely in some areas because of shortage of labor. But the, uh, the crop is the problem this year, the biggest problem. If there's no tomatoes out there and it's taking longer to fill bushels, it's costing more to pick, it's costing more to harvest. For City News, I'm Stella Quisto.